Hi, today we're going to talk about sexuality. We're going to talk about gender, gender identity, gender role. And we're also going to cover transsexual, transgender, we talk about gender identity disorder, and we cover people who have experienced these kinds of situations in their lives. Well, let's begin. What do we ask when a baby is born? We ask, is it a boy or a girl? A boy has a penis. A girl has a vagina. The answer, whether boy or girl, is what we call the sex of the child. So it may be male, it may be female. The sex is also the gender. Gender is genetic. Gender is determined by the genital. So if you transfer from one sex to the other, transsexual. From one gender to another, transgender. In biodata form, we see gender, male, female. In application form, we see gender, male, female. In September 2011, BBC News has reported that there are new Australian passports that allow third gender option. Now back to the beginning. After two to three years from the time that the child has been born, you ask the child, are you a boy or a girl? And the child will say, I am a boy. That is the identity. I am a girl. That is the identity. So the sex may be the outside. It is the external, the anatomic aspect. But the gender identity is the inner sense of the little boy or the inner sense of the little girl. So. Sex is outside, identity is inside. But then society enters the situation. Society assigns roles to boys and girls. Boys must play with toy guns. Girls must play with dolls. Boys should wear shorts. Girls should wear skirts. Boys will become construction workers in role-playing games. And girls, ballerinas. So, as society assigns these roles to boys and girls, we call this not sex, not gender, not gender identity, but we call this the gender role of the boy and the girl, of the male and the female. Hence, sex is the outer, and gender identity is the inner, and, well, gender role is dictated by society. But what if the sex is male or the gender is male and the gender role is you have to play with guns but the child tells you that I am a girl now what happens I am a boy but I am a girl this is the story of Bobby Montoya the boy who wants to be a girl scout he likes bats, Barbies, strawberry shortcake and these Mexican dolls. I like any girl stuff. Gender identity disorder, you may classify him under that. But for someone to be diagnosed with gender identity disorder, it's not enough that you're saying you're a boy but you're a girl. There has to be psychological distress in the process. There has to be harm to self or the child may be suicidal. But we don't see that in this child. So it couldn't be gender identity disorder. So what is the treatment for clients who have gender identity disorder? You're not going to change the identity, but you're going to help the client or help the child adapt to their gender identity. Some children with uh, gender identity concerns later on may become transsexuals or transgenders. An example is female to male, transsexual. Who is this? Originally born as Chastity, the daughter of Sonny and Cher, Chaz Bono grew up in the spotlight. Now the 42-year-old is gaining headlines with his new book, Transition, the story of how I became a man, chronicling his gender reassignment from female to male. So that was female to male. What about an example of male to female transsexual?
wear clothes of the opposite sex, also known as cross dressers. Like who? Like. I'm back! We're back. The search for America's next drag superstar. Got to drop, drop, drop it like it's hot. 